what's good YouTube, it's David from Creative Ice Media Group and I've been having quite a lot of messages about the neon lights on my YouTube layout a lot of people have been asking me, did you get that image of Google, did you um, did you make that um, image, blah 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 and I actually made these neon glow lights and decided to make the tutorial on how to do that alright what you want to do is go file new and uh, yeah 1280 by 720 is great press ok alright what you want to do is make the background black alright and make a new layer and with the pen tool whilst making sure you're on the path mode by clicking over here you want to uh, make crap, make the shape of the neon lights and the truth is I'm actually really bad with the pen tool it always takes me like ages to get what I want so yeah mine's going to look quite bad in this tutorial as I'm going to rush this but yours is going to look much better so once you've had one of your lines of your neon thing go to your brush tool make sure the hardness is on 100 and I'd say master diameter around 2 or 3 let me try 2 alright then go back to your pen tool whilst making sure your foreground color is white you want to right click stroke path choose brush and stimulate pressure press ok delete path yeah that's great now make a new layer and you wanna make a uh, crap you wanna make another okay you wanna make another neon light glowy line and for me that is gonna be okay I'm not gonna get into much detail again stroke path press ok delete path this is going to be fine for me. Now what you want to do is whilst pressing control click layer 2 and 1 and merge the layers. Now duplicate it and oops, sorry, and move it a bit out of place, duplicate it again move it a bit out of there, out of place, duplicate it again and you want to do this around 5 times so one more time alright then press shift whilst whilst being on the top layer press shift and click on the bottom layer which isn't the background okay so it's going to be layer 2 for me and merge layers duplicate that again duplicate that again and we, we're just trying to build up volume alright and then again uh, merge layers and I'll say one more time yeah I think that's great merge the layers again and at the end of that you should have something like this All right now what you want to do is col start coloring in so make a new layer let's name this neon lines blank okay because there's no color in them whatsoever and let's rename this so let me rename uh, colors all right what you want to do is choose a color so I'm going to choose I'm going to choose a light purple and we're going to make hardness on zero and I'll choose a brush around 200 and start coloring okay and change the mode to color all right make a new layer uh, I'll say red in the middle all right and just color in the middle change mode to soft light yeah soft light make a new one new layer and a green maybe and let's try green alright and again
again color yeah that looks great all right then make a new layer and we want a yellow and we're gonna color in a few spots change the opacity to around 40 and then overlay all right just gives it a little highlight all right cool uh, what you want to do is make a group so you can manage all of them and colors so I'm just gonna put all of those colors into there into the group so it's all nicely managed as you can see and what else is there in a second let me just check um, ah yes all right what I done extra was duplicate this edit transform horizontal right it doesn't always look good no I'm gonna keep it like that I kinda like that yeah so you can make it extra effects you can make it vertical or whatever it doesn't always look good but sometimes it does for me I'm just gonna leave it like this then what you wanna make is a new layer uh, choose the white color as your foreground color go to your brush tool and what you want to do is, yeah, click on the 19 brush, which is going to be good. Zoom in, start clicking. Sorry about that, one second. Make sure um, the layer that you just created is above the group, so it would actually be white. Start clicking in random places. All right. Alright, then you want 13 size brush, partner zero, and make it next to it. Alright. You can make them different colours, I'm just gonna make them white. Alright, and then size nine, again hardness zero. And next to that one. There we go. And that is about it. You can make as many of those little white things, whatever you want to call them. Uh, little special effects. Um, you can make as many as you want, different colors, different places. You don't have to make them, but that is how you make glowing neon lines. Uh, yeah. So favorite this video if you liked it. Comment on your opinions on this. If I can improve it or whatever, whatever you think, just comment. Write me a nice comment. I like reading them. Uh, rate it five stars because I'm a cool guy. Uh, what else? Make a video response. I've had a few video responses um, of people actually doing what making actual work so for instance make this what I just made and just make a video and put it as a video response I love getting this kind of feedback and if you like this video also subscribe add me as a friend I love making new friends um, yeah uh, thank you for everyone that's supported me so far thank you for Stephanie good friends <laughs> yeah thank you Stephanie for supporting me thanks everyone and yeah till next time peace